All right, everybody, welcome back to the big collection. Uh, one, two, three, four, the fourth episode of opening this wonderful collection that came to me this week from miles away. Let's get started. We've got Matchbox, we've got Johnny Lightnings, and we've got Hot Wheels, and I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to be unwrapping in this part of the video, but we will find out. Oh, it's a Matchbox. This one is called the Ferret Scout Car. It's supposed to have a little scout guy sitting in there, but he is not there. He's long gone, but that's okay because nobody really cares about those old military Johnny Lightnings. But now here is something. Oh, look at that. It's a nice brown, kind of a brownie orange color. And it's got the uh, scatter, uh, The uh, this is for the lane counter that you put on the back. These are hard to find. And then there's the flags are even harder, like a little plastic thing that sticks up. So that's pretty cool. There was some racing going on with this. This is the March F1. Got the uh, decal on this side of the sticker. That's a neat color. I don't think I have this color in my collection. I'm definitely going to put that guy in my collection. There's a few nice sizzlers in here. I haven't worked on my sizzler collection in ages. Next one up is another Johnny Lightning again. Whoops, things are falling off here. Again with all pipes and the motors. And whoops, come on. I just dropped that on the floor. I don't want to lose that motor. Come on. There you go. And the window. That's so cool. I think um I know I need the windows for my my display for sure. Yeah, that's nice. This one, um oh, let's see, how's that go on there? Like that. Yeah. The windows are really hard. The, some of the, a lot of the blister packs did not have the windows in them, uh, but the race sets had the windows in them. So there it is. That's a nice one. I like the Johnny Lightning Dragster. Without the, if anything's wrong with a Johnny Lightning Dragster, then nobody will buy that. So that's no fun. It's fun to have them with everything on it. Here's another tank. Again, with the bent barrel, armored Saladin. Those kind of cars I put in my antique mall space. People like to look at them. They don't really buy them, but they like to look at them. Oh, look at this. Here's another really nice Sizzler car. You can see the battery acid inside there. Got to get that cleaned out of there. And then it's another lap counter bit on the back there. That's cool. Very nice. Very nice original chrome on that. Now, you got to be careful. You don't want to wash that because a lot of times the chrome is just ready to fall off. And uh, I'm going to actually put that... I don't want to get battery acid on my blanket here. Let's put these over here. On a towel. Next one up is... Oh, look at that. Yeah, that's pretty. I haven't had my Sizzlers on display for ages. I think I will put the Sizzlers on my main display because they are so pretty. They, uh, you know, you can't tell by looking at, you know, ones that are worn like that. But, you know, hey, they can be beautiful. They really can be so beautiful, the Sizzlers. They are so stylish. And here's another lap counter piece. Wow, that's neat. I've never seen this many lap counter pieces. Here's one, the chrome one. This one easily gets eaten up by the by the battery acid. It's not hard to open these up. You just cut off the little edges of that and um, go ahead and open up the car and get that battery acid out of there. I think, I can't remember, is it ammonia or is it vinegar that you use to clean that up? You take the wheels off the chassis, wash those in soap and water, and then you put the chassis in some, I think it's ammonia to eat the acid off of the car. It's another Sizzler. This one, a flat out. Great car, flat out. And another lap counter. Can't wait to put those to good use. Racing Sizzlers. I think I sold all my track. Guess I'll have to buy some more track again. And here we got a Seasider in the rose color. A few nicks on it. Boat's probably in here somewhere. I don't know, but I've got extra boats I've saved over the years, so no problem there. Didn't know there's going to be more Hot Wheels. Ah, look at that. Two of everything. That's so cool. I think Mom made him kept one. Look at this one's got a flaw in the motor. That's funny. Or the side pipe. That's funny. It's got the boat on it. So there's two new Seasiders for the collection. I like Seasiders. They're really nice. What's this? What's this? Uh, custom T-Bird. Pretty decent for U.S. U.S. are always beat up. Pretty decent. It's got some wear on it, but it's a real decent little car. 
decent, decent. Just keep opening them, opening and opening and opening and opening, and school bus. Nice little school bus. Let's see if we have any flaws here. No, nah, looks pretty good. A lot of times this piece will crack up on you, break off. Sometimes that'll be missing, the orange thing. Sometimes this base will be warped, but this one's good shape. Good shape. I like the school bus. can always use another school bus. S, -S school bus, and I think there's two of them. Again, two with the S school bus. Let's see if we got any flaws here. And looks good. Yeah, looks good. Nice. And I got the sticker over here for that one. So two S school buses. I've never gotten two S school buses at the same time before. And you can push it down, get it to sit down. And every S school bus is a different shade of yellow, you will find. All the way from dark to light. Different shade. Another Sizzler. This one, the Backfire. Still got pretty good wheels on this one. That'd be some cleaning to do on a later date. Right there. All right. And now we've got, what do we got here? It's kind of small. Oh, the cat cab for the uh, racer rig. Oh, look, it's pretty nice. It's darkened, so it's got a lot of toning. The window's good, and there's no wear across the top here. That's very unusual. Very unusual. So that's nice. That's very nice. And then we got here. What have you got here? Hmm. Oh, triple threat dragster in the red. Triple threat. Triple threat. Well, it's a good thing I called back on this collection. It was that Harry Holler that really got me. This must be all Matchbox, the rest of this batch, because there was a bunch of Matchbox. What is that, a rock? I think I got a rock. And no... A swingy wing in pink. A little toning on it, but otherwise nice. Yeah, what the heck? Swingy wing in pink. Usually those are magenta a lot. I thought this was going to be all matchbox over here. Nope. Johnny Lightning, triple thread dragster, another one in red. How cool is that? It's so cool. Right there. Beautiful. Beauty, eh? And, oh, now we're getting down to the matchbox. Oh, good, good. That's a nice tow truck. This one with the decal comes in with either. Oh, this one's the sticker actually. They come. This one comes in a sticker or a decal. And this sticker got put on wrong. And then this red comes in red or gray, and it, the red also can come in a double line hook. That was actually a nice matchbox, and I got a box for that. I've been waiting to get a one to put in a box. Here he's got the snow track tractor with the dried out treads. Pretty typical of the snow track. This one's a little flexible. This one's completely dry, but I've got replacements for that. This one has the embossed snow track on the side, which is cool. I like the one the best that has the white snow track track on there. And this one, oh, there we go. It's a combine harvester. Not a super popular model, but this one is unplayed with, so that's cool. I got a box for that, I think. Very nice, very nice. And here we got the police car. That's a popular model. This one has been played within the dirt. Still got the dirt on it. Oops, there we go. Played within the dirt. Still got dirt on it. And yeah, we can wash that off. It's in halfway decent shape. Not real great. Again, the matchboxes pretty much need to be mint and boxed. They're real big, popular. Ambulance. Got a few nicks on it. Decent. Decent. All right. Matchbox. Oh, because, oh, I like this one. This is the Ferrari race car with the little Ferrari driver man. He's so cute. He's kind of tiny. Kind of tiny. Isn't that nice? Boy, we are really floating all over the place here with the focus. Let's slide over here. We have less background. 
move my rock, I'll put it inside there. And we got, oh, Jumbo Crane. I love the Jumbo Crane. This one with the red, some of them are yellow. They'll wear around there. Still looks nice. I just like that one. It's fun. We're getting down to the end here, finally. Oh, it's exhausting. Oh, that one's an old one. That one's an old one. Sometimes people say, oh, it's well-loved, but I would be like, hmm, boy, huh. I hope you don't love other things like that. It's all beat up. Come on. But this, most of these cars are pretty darn nice. Most just have just a little light wear like this one. This is the smuggler. Smuggling the booze back there, I guess. Kind of funny. This one is a dump truck. Oh, that's one that's been played with. Put that one on there. And got only a few more. And this one is the little Lang Dumper. I like this one. This one actually just has a little dirt on it, but otherwise it's pretty nice. It's hard to get this one, it seems like. I did get one the other day in a box, so that was nice. And this one is the 26 Cement Mixer, Cement Lorry, they call it. And um, it's got the gray wheels, which is cooler than the black sometimes. And then next one is another smuggler. This time in the orange. Super dark, darkened, but still it's orange, so that's cool. A little smuggler on the Johnny Lightning. 47 models in the Johnny Lightning lineup. And there's a pipe truck with all the pipes. And the pipes have dirt in them. <laughs> I'll put that over there. All right, pipes with dirt in them. And getting down there to the end. Boat and trailer. Everybody loves the boat and trailer. And this boat and trailer has been in the dirt. <laughs> I still got the dirt in it. Or I guess the dirt's been in the boat and trailer. And we'll put that in there. We just have to wash her off. She's fine. Everybody loves boat and trailer on their display. And we got a nice little Jaguar. Nice little Jaguar. It's got a little scuffing on there that might polish off. It's decent shape. That's a fun one. I really like that one. The English Jaguar. And then there's the Mongoose and Snake set and a couple of other things. And there's another Leapin' Limo. Got all six pipes. Orange. Good shape. A little dull on the bottom. Very nice. Very, very nice. Look at that. That's funny. It's got the model numbers over there. That's neat. And the last one in this bunch is the Land Rover number 12. Safari Land Rover. This one comes in blue with either light tan or dark tan luggage. Or it comes in green, which is much harder to find with the tan luggage. I think it's dark tan. I don't know, but you can always change them around because the luggage comes off. You can pull that off if you want. And that is all to that. Is there anything else? What else is down there? Come on. Let's see. Get these trays out of the way. I know. I'm going to take this camera off here. And let's go over here. I'm gonna step on something, aren't I? And see what's in these. I think these are empty. These are the cars for the Sizzlers. This one is the March F1, that's cool. And flat out, cool. I think there's a box for each one, that's pretty cool. Ford Mark IV, it's gonna make a nice display. I've never put any on display because I've never really had any this nice, sort of. I just kind of shine them on. Anteater. Balls. Don't touch. Do not touch. That's the way I feel about toys. Do not touch my toys. Ford Mark IV. Cool. All right. And then the two cases, one of them's clean. One of them's damaged. And then there's Hot Wheels Factory. I'll make a video out of that. Maybe we'll make a car. It's a nice packing material. This, And then we've got the Mongoose Wild Wheelie set. I hope it's good. Let's look inside. One thing nice about this box is one end has never been opened, so it's still pretty sturdy. This has been taken pretty good care of. They didn't rip the... Um, there was a bunch of places where the where the wrapping paper had been on it for Christmas. That's still on there. I'll get some stuff on there and work that off, and then there's some strapping tape over here on the end. But let's see what's inside. Nicely packed up, it looks like. Packing material. 
Come on, material. There's the instruction manual. Oh, look, the catalog. Wow, that's crisp, too. That's no stink or anything. Nice. There's a bag of goodies. That's pretty cool. I don't know what that is. Wait a minute. That doesn't go in here. What is that? Hmm. I don't know what that is, but it looks like it's an important piece of something. It doesn't go in this. It got the wind stickers. It's got the yeah. We got all the little uh, rubber bands and got the things there. Another baggie. The baggies are still in there. Here is the. Um, what is that? This is the shoot box. Looks unused, really. Here's the uh, the congratulations, and here's the sticker sheet left over. Boy, they did not throw away anything, did they? Here's uh, what's this? Oh, the cars are here. Cool. Wow, we. That's nice. I didn't even realize the cars were in the collection. I thought I didn't. Don't think I saw them or wasn't paying attention or something. That's so nice. Look at that. It's beautiful. It's really got pretty stickers on it. Both of them. Let's see. Here is the start starting device. Nicely wrapped. Really nice. Still got some rubber bands on it. There's another piece of something here from some other set. And let's see. These are intact, it looks like. The bumpers are there, and they're still flexible. Oh, look at that. These are put on there real nice. Really nice. A perfectionist. Very nice. Start. And then there's the finish gate. There's more packing. And then the big belter. The big belter. And this is the big belter. That's the thing that makes the car spring out. And then there's the matchmaker. Let's see if the matchmaker works. Hey, it does work. Let's see if I can hold this up and do this. All right, come on, Dave. Let's see if I can do this. So you pull that up and it... go. That's how that's supposed to work. These stickers didn't get on there quite right. I wonder if I could change that at all. It looks nice. It's in good shape. Very nice. Definitely going to be putting this on display. Let's see what else is in that box. Anything? Got all the track. And I think that's all. But that'll definitely go on display. Now, I used to have one of these that was sealed. That was really cool. Got it from Hawaii years and years ago. But I eventually sold that. So, anyway, that's all there is for this collection. Thank you for joining me in this giant collection opening video. And please be sure to watch all my videos. I have over 300 videos. Please tell your friends. I need to get my channel to get set on fire. Literally. No, not literally. Figuratively. So I can get more watchers and viewers. And, and uh, spread the word about collecting Redline Hot Wheels. We love them. I love them. And you love them too. So, Or is that you? 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 Me? You? I don't know. All right. That's all. Kind of tired here. Whoa. I just got through talking for over an hour. So... Anyway, thanks for joining me. I sure appreciate any, uh, just leave your uh, thumbs up. And uh, like I say, I'm really tired, so I better sign off now. All right then, bye.